Okay, so if you flip your worksheet over, number seven, um, we're solving for P, but we've got kind of a lot going on here. We've got an exponent here, I've got stuff in the parentheses, and then I have P on this side. So I need to get all of this stuff figured out and move it to that side, and get, isolate P. So first I'm gonna do, just to get this out of the way, 12 times six and the exponent is 72. So I'm gonna use that, okay? Um, then it's parentheses first. So we're gonna do 0 0.09 divided by 12. 0 0.09 divided by 12. Okay, then we're gonna add one. So calculator, if you can see, now I'm gonna say plus one. Okay, 1.0075 is where I'm at. And I'm going to leave that in the calculator. I'm going to raise it to the 72 power. So how do I do that? I hit my little uh, triangle looking thing. And I hit raise to the 72nd power. Okay. Then we're there. I'm going to leave that in my calculator. Um, now, so this is kind of fancy with the calculator. I have P times everything that I just did here. It's about 1.71255, a long expansion there. So I want to get the most exact answer, okay, uh, equal to, okay. So I want to have 12,000 in my calculator, and I want to then divide by this number. So how am I going to do that? I'll do, I'm going to type in 12,000. Okay, and I'm dividing by this whole expansion. To do that, I hit second, and then at the bottom, A and S is above your negative here. So that's saying, call back the last answer. So 12,000 divided by this is gonna get me P, and I get 7,007, and then we'll say to the nearest hundredth, 0.08. That's gonna be equal to P. So. Hopefully you can follow all that work in the calculator. And there's our answer. Thank you.